For those of us who are excited by the idea of space travel, we recently got some good news. NASA has made it clear they plan to land humans on Mars as early as the mid-2030s. That means ideas and hardware designed to get us to Mars are now being ramped up to meet this challenge. But if you ask anyone who has ever been involved with a Mars mission, they will tell you that successfully landing on or orbiting Mars is incredibly difficult. In fact, of the 40 missions that humans have currently sent to Mars, only 16 have been successful. So getting everything exactly right will be at the forefront of everyone's mind. One of the major challenges that face NASA researchers is how to get really heavy equipment onto the surface of Mars. Popular movies and science fiction articles make landing on a planet look easy. But in fact, that is one of the hardest elements to achieve. There are a host of aerodynamic and physics issues that engineers need to overcome. First and foremost is decelerating a spacecraft, traveling many times faster than a bullet and allowing it to gently land with precision onto another planetary surface hundreds of millions of miles away. Right now, the maximum weight we can land on Mars is roughly about one metric ton. But when humans arrive, we will need to land hundreds of metric tons onto the surface. The only way to accomplish this feat is to innovate and come up with a new strategy. A small group of dedicated NASA engineers, researchers, designers, and craftsmen are currently working on making a safe entry into the Mars atmosphere possible. The project is called HIAD, or the Hypersonic Inflatable Aerodynamic Decelerator, and it promises to redefine what it means to land on other planets with atmospheres like Mars.